Qualification match number six begins in three, two, one, go. Match six on the move. Robots exiting that front launch zone, looking for three points apiece. Let's get a real close look and see if those robots are completely clear. And they are. That's three points for red, three points for blue from that near uh, near launch zone. It looks like they are clear. We'll get an official call on that when we check out our scores for this match. In the meantime, just a few seconds left in auto until we transition to driver control. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. Drivers in control now. All four robots move in real quick. First on the move, we see Open Source 23213, a beautiful 3D printed turret up at the top of their robot with a rubber band intake spinning rapidly to get those artifacts up into the body of their launcher. And it is accurate. Seven that eight artifacts already scored by the Blue Alliance. Their alliance partner, 27372 Robolutionaries, they have what looks very close to the Go Build a Kit Bot. They are doing a great job getting some gravity-fed artifacts into the body of their robot. They're going to drive right on up to their alliance partner, Open Source. Robolutionaries with a simple launch right on up and in. Three points for the Blue Alliance. Blue Alliance has already opened up their gate to give them more opportunity to get artifacts to pass through the square to be classified. Those artifacts worth three points apiece. We can only fit nine artifacts in those ramps. Those first nine are worth three points apiece, but any extras that roll over the top are going to be worth only one point. So teams can choose to open up that gate, remove Move any pattern they might have established and then continue scoring through the remainder of the match. Checking in on our score, Blue Alliance is in the lead 61 to 18 with 35 seconds remaining in the match. LiDAR sensors with a launch from the near launch line, their alliance partner Triad. It looks like Triad is trying to make sure they're going to be perfectly lined up inside of the base zone for the Red Alliance. If they are able to be completely inside and their partner is able to get just a little bit of support from that base zone, they might be able to pick up a bonus ranking point in this match. Right now, both robots are partially in. That's 10 points for both being partially in. As long as they stay there, we're coming down now to the final three, two, one. That wraps up qualification match number six. We will have results for the last match we played over here on field two. That was match number six. That win goes to the Blue Alliance, a score of 98 to 39.